What's going on guys? So, I know, I know, Lightning Overdrive fucking sucks, right? There's really nothing good in here. Uh, the Ruddy Roses actually went up in price. But, here's the thing. It was either this, or um, I was gonna buy a box of Burst of Destiny, but we've been opening it a lot, so fuck it. And then, I already had these. They're just sitting here, so I was like, might as well open them. Because if you guys remember, I was going freaking crazy crazy trying to find some diviners for a tournament i had and we we opened i don't remember fuck what did we open did we open like four boxes of lightning overdrive trying to pull a diviner and we didn't pull any at all and then i ended up having to buy them off of somebody and then these just sat here so instead of going and buying one box for you guys to open i decided fuck it let's open these three so let's go ahead and uh let's hope we we pull the, if we pull a freaking, okay, obviously, I mean, yeah, let's pull a divine because we can sell it, right? But the thing is, if we pull a div like diviners out of here, I'm gonna be so pissed because I needed them a long time ago. But let's go ahead and uh, get into it. Let's see what we, uh... hmm, this is so weird. We're all these packs, okay, so. That's weird. I don't think I've ever seen that before. Have you guys ever seen that? The packs being upside down? That's weird. Okay. Well, let's, let's hope the, the, the cards aren't tampered with. Let's see. ZW Dragonic Halberd? I'm not really gonna try to pronounce all this stuff. Fuck it. There's so many bad secrets in this set. It's freaking horrible. The only thing, ah, uh, no, amazing time ticket. There we go. Horrible, horrible, horrible. There's really nothing in here that we can pull to make our money back. It's freaking nuts, but, oh shoot, what am I doing? I only bought the, I only bought a bunch because I needed the diviners and there was nobody who had them um not even my locals like everybody was out and last minute some dude hit me up he's like yo i got two of them and then i already had one so we got lucky there oh okay that's our first ultra right there come on let's see really the only thing we can hope for at this point is a starlight to try to make our money back because I think I paid close to like 200 or a little over 200 for the three boxes. Fuck, how much did I pay? Um, yeah, I think it was something like that. I'm really excited for uh, Brothers of Legend. Oh my goodness, I'm excited for that. I hope we can pull a freaking droplet from there. I need a playset for sure. This droplet is such a good card. It really makes the, like a, it can, it's a game winning card. That card really makes a difference. If you pull, I mean, if you pull, if you freaking open up a droplet, it can really um, help you win the game. Especially like if you combo it with a evenly match. Oh my goodness. It, it makes the card so much better. Let's see. Go ahead and do this side. Bunch of bullshit secrets. Like, even a ready rose would only give you maybe half your money back. Where am I putting the supers? Over here. And then the diviner. The diviner wouldn't even pay for the freaking, uh, for the box either. Because they fluctuate around like 40, 45, 50. Yeah, see, this secret's a fucking dollar. Horrible secret. This is just a bad set overall. It's a horrible set. To be honest, I think I'd rather open up the, the freaking gold series in this freaking set. But, yep, my bad guys. I just, they're here already. I already paid for them, so fuck it, you know? It's, this isn't a set I want to collect anyways. Like, it's not a set I would want to keep sealed. I already have a, I already have some blister packs that I'm keeping sealed. Uh, to collect from all the newer sets, including this one, so I'm good just off that. Let's 
she but yeah i mean honestly we can only hope for a starlight that's really the only thing that can really save us here because everything else is just freaking garbage i'm only one box in though so we still gotta open the other two You know what though? I do want to pull a Diviner just because we haven't pulled one yet and we opened so many boxes. So, fuck it. Might as well see if we would have pulled one. Actually, I'm really curious. Like, if I would have opened these, like if the dude never hit me up, right? And I didn't get the, the Diviners in time and I relied on these three boxes, would we have pulled the two diviners that we needed. I mean, for sure, we needed at least one. Okay, so that's it. Um, three ultras and two secrets. Did we miss an ultra? Let me check. We did not. How many? Nineteen, twenty, three, one, two, two, three, 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 four. Okay. All right. So yeah, that's uh. That's that box there. We'll go ahead and set that there. Let's go ahead and get to the second one. Ah, would we have pulled a diviner if we needed to? Let's see. Is there a way to, uh, to know? Like when you open a case, is there a way to know where all the, the like specific secrets are gonna be? Because I swear, Blazing Vortex, people were selling boxes with absolutely no freaking chance of getting Pot of Prosperity. And I don't know if there's a way to tell when you open up a case, um, kind of like where the secrets are going to be, like what secrets, uh, Starlight, stuff like that. But who knows? There's some people out there that are so freaking good at scamming that uh, it honestly just freaking surprises me. Actually, that's pretty dope. I'll take that um, because I'm actually trying to build that deck little by little, but it's not my main focus. Um, in my opinion, that's like a, a tier two, a tier two deck. So I'm not really like in a rush to, to build that. Let's see what we have here. Nothing. War Rock Spirit. You know what? I'm actually kind of curious to know what you guys play. Let me know in the comments what uh what deck you guys are playing right now. I really want to know. I want to get an idea of what everybody's playing. And also, I kind of want to see what the majority of people are playing. Like if some of your guys' comments um, well like if some of you guys run the same deck as others let's see so no secret on this side oh no this set's already trash don't tell me we're only gonna get one secret wow that is fucking trash oh okay all right, my back hurts. Dark Honest, there we go. It's one. It was the first one, so maybe there's a chance we do get our second. So far, it looks like there's no way in hell we would have got that divine. But we'll see, we'll see. Springing card. Ultra thing. All right. So far we have three ultras, one secret. So we're still looking for another secret and another ultra. Come on. 
Come on, let's go. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Damn, this is so bad. Ah. It's funny because when I needed the cards, when I needed the diviners, I didn't mind spending all the money getting all these boxes. And now that I have the diviners and I don't really need anything from here, it's such a pain knowing how much I paid and then opening these is just so freaking bad. And then there being a chance that we're only gonna get one secret because there's only three packs left. Let's see. Is there another ultra? So we got another ultra. Did we only get one? Oh no. Don't do that. Wow, no, that's horrible. That is fucking trash. Oh my God. Low key, there's actually, there's a Konami building here in Vegas. This makes me want to go freaking burn that building down. This is horrible. This is so depressing. All right, well, that's insane. This card's what, like $3, $4? Imagine spending 70 bucks for a fucking box and then pulling something like that. That's so stupid. And then this card's like a dollar. Konami pissed me off, I swear. Yeah, because it's not like we missed a secret. All right, whoa. Last box right here. Freaking $200 down the drain. That's insane. You know what? I really did actually need those cards, but uh, looks like we wouldn't have pulled them anyways. We'll see if uh, we get at least one. What's going on here? Why isn't this uh... okay? Well, I guess I'll just take that. Side. What's going on with this? Why is this uh, well, it's kind of ripped. All right, well, I'll throw that away. Um, all right, well. Here we go. Hopefully we get three secrets from here. Oh my God, if we get one secret again, no. That's uh, no. Come on. We've opened so many boxes of this set that, like how have we not pulled a Starlight yet? That's insane. There. Damn, I have so much bulk at this point. It's crazy. Super. All right, come on. Ah, another. That's insane. This set has so many freaking secrets that are only worth like a dollar. It's so freaking annoying. So there's no chance in hell we would have pulled a diviner. Wow. Well then it's a good thing I freaking... Um, it's a good thing I bought them because if I relied on these boxes, I would have been fucked. Is there an ultra there? Oh, what am I doing? Okay. Uh, come on. A starlight is honestly the only thing that can save us here. The only freaking thing. Last pack on the right side. Are we... We got two ultras and the secret so far. Okay, so that's uh, sounds about right. All right, let's see. We got a light charmer. S force. You know what deck is actually good that I went against? Um, 
the Fluanderies. They actually weren't that bad. And the thing is, they're new, so when there's new sets coming out, it, there's a big chance of them getting more support, so it's not bad at all. Come on, man. Give me one freaking diviner at least. One freaking diviner. You tell me we opened ah, this fucking shit. Got so many secrets that don't worth anything. It's insane. Yo, how the fuck has nobody like boycotted Konami or something over over that? Because I honestly think it's bullshit how there can be a new set. Obviously, Lightning Overdrive isn't new anymore. But let's take uh, Burst of Destiny, for example, right? It's a new set. And there are secrets in there that are already worth a dollar. Imagine spending almost $100 for a box. And the best card you can pull, the best rarity... They're dollar freaking cards. All right, last pack right here. What do we got? We got this fucking crap. Fuck! All right, that was horrible. That was fucking horrible. All right, well, these are all just supers. That doesn't matter. These supers. So we're gonna put this here, and then we have. One less secret and ratio. And then we have all these ultras. Alright, so we'll go through the ultras. So this is pretty much what we got. Alright, and then this oh well, I guess that was already. And then the secrets. This is I'm pretty sure it's like 80 cents. I know there's like a dollar. This is like four or five bucks, I think. I know this is less than a dollar. And then this is probably a couple bucks. That's insane, dude. How can there be so many secrets in a, in a set that aren't even worth five bucks? That's fucking insane. Honestly, I feel like when there's a new set, like there should be good secrets in there, like to the point where at least you're not gonna pull something less than like 10, 15 bucks, man. Like, how are you gonna have a brand new set and then you're gonna have freaking the, the, the best rarity cards in there, which you only get two of, sometimes fucking one, and it, it could be worth a dollar. Konami, what the fuck, man? What y'all doing? Ah, all right. Well, this video is pretty much just me complaining about uh, Konami shit. But let me know if you guys agree, though. Let me know if you guys agree with that. I think it's bullshit. Like, how the fuck? Like, they don't treat their their players right. I, that's what I feel like. I feel like they're they're a little greedy. They're a little greedy. They uh they release new sets and then they. Maybe not greedy, but lazy. Because even with the newer sets, they keep reprinting stuff that had like, there's cards that have had like three rep reprints in the same year and they still reprint it again. And it's like, yo, reprint something else, bro. Like, um, like I remember the Sky Striker Rose, I think it was. Like everybody was excited for it to get reprinted in the tins. And then they got reprinted like two more times, I think. And it's like, yo, that, okay, it got reprinted already, chill, like, go on to the next thing, what the fuck? Uh, what else, what else? There was a, there was some other cards that got reprinted, but whatever. All right, guys, um, well, let's get into the giveaway. Um, let me go find the cards, and then I'll be right back. All right, ladies, so I switched up the, uh, um, the recording room. I had it downstairs, uh, but I moved everything upstairs, and then... I said, fuck it, might as well change the mat too. So we're gonna use this mat from now on until I get a new one. I wanted to get one with Stardust, but okay. So the giveaway, we have all the gold cards, right? One of you guys win all that. Plus the rainbow dragon, um, what, not rainbow, what the fuck? I guess, I mean, you gotta summon this dude, but the crystal beast uh, deck, um, all the hollows I think are from the raw yellow mega packs that we opened. Which we are gonna open more. 
and I have like a halfway built um, crystal bead stack. Apart from this, I still have like more of this stuff. So when we open those mega packs, and if we can complete something like this again, then I'll do another one. Um, so we got that, all the gold cards, the gold blue eyes, right? And oh yeah, I think that's it. Okay, so same thing. We have the URL. We're gonna filter duplicate users just because we don't want, um, you know, if people comment 10 times, we don't want them to get 10 en entries. And then we're gonna hit start. Shirokuma Otaku. Shirokuma, Shirokuma Otaku. All right, man, you won the... My bad, I was, I was reading the, the comment he left. That's cool though, it tells you the comment that they that they left. Um, you won all this stuff, man. So go ahead and message me, Instagram or email me and uh, I'll get this stuff out there to you. Just so you guys know, by the way, I only ship stuff out once a month. So if you guys have won giveaways and you're wondering why you haven't got them yet, um, it's because right now I'm only shipping stuff once a month. My schedule's really freaking packed. Um, Ashwin, if you're watching this, I'm still working on your stuff, man. Um, I'm trying to figure out because Ashwin actually won a couple, uh, a couple giveaways, and I, I just have been having problems with uh, with my USPS. So I gotta really see, I gotta see exactly what he's won, and then I have to find it in all the freaking mess I have. Um, but if not, then hell, man, like. Let me know if you want me to just send you a booster box or something. I'll be cool with that. Um, just so I don't have to go digging through all that stuff. But okay. So the video was kind of crappy just because it was lightning overdrive. The pulls freaking sucked. Um, I just didn't feel like opening another burst really. And locals don't really have any older stuff. Um, so I was either stuck with um, Dawn of Majesty or Burst. Like, like that's really... Um, and I already had the lighting overdrive and I actually was kind of curious to see would we have got the diviners for the tournament in time and Thank God I bought them because that yeah, that was horrible. Oh Yeah, so I'm, I'm listening to uh, Vicente Fernandez while I'm cleaning the house and um, I Know this video is probably gonna get like demonetized and stuff, but it doesn't really matter because we're not even at a thousand subscribers So it's not like we're getting paid for YouTube or anything so what the heck, might as well um, stay in my vibe, you know? Okay, so uh, to make up for the crappy ass freaking video, I'm gonna have a kind of, it's gonna be a pretty good freaking giveaway guys. So we're gonna have another deck. This is going to be battling boxers. So there's pretty much three of everything in here. This deck was so much fun when it was out. I freaking love this deck. Um, so, oh, it has the XYZ too. Honestly, I don't even remember. I build a lot of cores and then like, I just leave them <laughs> and I don't even remember what's in it. So that's cool, it has the XYZ too. And then we're gonna have a dual terminal Vorse Raider. And then we're gonna have these two sealed Lost Art um, cards. But that's not it. Here's the thing. I'm also gonna be giving away this Cosmo Blazer mat. Uh, this is actually a two player mat. It's too big for me to show. Um, so if you guys know what a two player mat is, I mean, it, it's pretty much this twice. Um, it's a, it's freaking huge. Um, it's big enough for both players to play. Um, the only thing is it's Cosmo Blazer, so it's not gonna have link zones, but you can just place the, the, the field center and go off of that. So one of you guys will win this mat right here, the two lost art uh, promos, the Vorse Raider dual terminal, and the battle and boxer deck. And as you guys know, if I post videos in between the, the week, um, sometimes I add more to the giveaway. So, so far this is what's gonna be the giveaway for, oh shoot, for next week. So obviously make sure you leave a comment in this video, like it, subscribe if you're not subscribed, um oh yeah i gotta use the other website there's another website that lets me filter out the people that aren't subscribed so we'll probably do that because y'all need to be subscribing <laughs> but yeah just 
make sure you do that because that's gonna get you entered for this. And then we'll go ahead and um, announce the winner next Monday. We also have Brothers of Legend coming up. Uh, December 3rd, if I'm not mistaken, is a Friday. So I can pick some up and then record and have that video Monday. We could do that. So that's what's most like, that's probably what we're gonna do for next Monday. Next Monday will be Brothers of Legend. Um, in between the, like throughout the week, um, I was honestly thinking another Korean box maybe, or we'll see. I did want to open another legendary collection too. Um, oh guys, so I do have big news for you guys. Hopefully you guys watched all the way up to this point. Um, we're going to do a box battle with Cyber Knight. Um, we're probably going to be doing that mid-December. But I went ahead and emailed Cyber Knight and I told him, look, um, if you're down, we can do a, let's do a box battle and I'll pay for the whole thing. And just so it can sound more appealing, like, um, someone as big as Cyber Knight, if you hit him up and you're like, yo, let's do a box battle with Burst of Destiny. And be like, man, what the hell? But if you hit him up and you're like, yo, let's do a box battle with the Duelist Genesis or Crossroads of Chaos or something like that. And I'll pay for the whole thing then they're gonna be like, oh shit, all right, fuck it, why not? Um, so I told him, I went ahead and messaged him, and yeah, he agreed, so we're gonna go ahead and do that um, mid-December. That's another uh, treat for you guys for Christmas, but I do have some other stuff planned for Christmas as well. Um, and as you guys know, I also send Ruxin uh, stuff. Um, he hasn't replied to me though, so I don't know if, I don't know if he wants to keep doing like the deal we had or if that's it. But if not, I mean, I guess we're just gonna move on to Cyber Knight, uh, JRB Jobber. We had some stuff planned too. Um, we're getting out there guys, we're getting out there. So thanks for watching guys. Hope you guys have a wonderful Monday and yeah, make sure you guys get entered for this awesome freaking giveaway for next Monday. But I'll see you guys in the next video, peace.